So we go again in the parasitical long axis view. We first oriented the marker towards the right shoulder and we have the heart in the center of the image. And now we adapt the parasitical long axis and move it a bit towards the left atrium and we save the image. What we can see if uh, we apply color Doppler are two structures entering the left atrium, which are the pulmonic veins. You can see them over here entering the left atrium. So it's even possible in the personal long axis to display the pulmonic veins. To continue in the personal long axis, we can move intercostal spaces up and down. Depending on what we do, we can either see the apex if we move downwards and so if you move upwards and tilt the transducer downwards, we can see the right ventricular inflow view with the right atrium and the right ventricle. In detail, we can differentiate, uh, differentiate here the IVC um, entering here in the right atrium and here the coronary sinus. We can also apply color Doppler to see if there is tricuspid regurgitation as well as we can denote the inflow of the inferior vena cava and the coronary sinus.